Bizarre details continue to emerge in the double homicide and suicide involving professional wrestler Chris Benoit and his wife and child. In addition to the oddity of a murder in Fayette County, the office of Benoit's physician was raided, and the official timeline of tragic events is being disputed, most notably with a posting on Wikipedia about the deaths more than 14 hours before the bodies were discovered. You're familiar with weights that are, are attached to a pulley. It was the cord on the weights. When you found the uh, scripts and drugs and the steroids, were they near his body? When did you find them in the house? I don't know. No one was injured seriously Monday morning in a two-car crash at the intersection of Georgia Highway 92 and Lees Mill Road. One of the drivers was taken to Southern Regional Hospital. Getting ready for hiking, running, water sports, or just relaxing? Save on all casual and outdoor clothing and footwear at Smith & Davis. Choose from styles by Nike, Adidas, Mizuno, New Balance, Brooks, and more. Smith & Davis is located on Highway 54 between Fayetteville and Peachtree City. Open Monday through Friday, 9.30 to 7, Saturday, 9.30 to 6, and Sundays, 1 to 6. The 4th of July will feature a number of local activities. In addition to the annual Peachtree City Parade and Fireworks, Noonan will host a parade at 6 p.m. with fireworks beginning when it gets dark. Atlanta Motor Speedway will move their Thursday Thunder event to Wednesday and will include their own massive fireworks display. If you want to get your fireworks in early, Sonoya Raceway will hold their fireworks on Saturday night. Stay tuned for a look ahead at next week's news after a word from our sponsor. Hi, I'm Kelly. And I'm Mike. From Smith & Davis. We've got all the latest threads and kicks from Quicksilver, Roxy, Rainbow, Reef, and Crocs. And all at great prices every day. At Smith & Davis, we're always happy to help you. So come by and see us today. Next week, we'll have a recap of the local 4th of July activities and a look at the Twilight Theater production of Les Miserables. Thanks for tuning in.